The quiet rural community of Orange, New South Wales has historically been known for pastoral sheep farms, orchards and wineries. Gold was first discovered in the district in the 1850s. But by the 1950s, gold mining ceased as it became uneconomical to mine with the technology of the time. That changed in 1992 with the discovery of Cadia Hill by Newcrest Mining. The Cadia Hill ore body is a large, low-grade ore body which lends itself to economies of scale through the use of bulk mining and ore treatment technologies. The Cadia East deposit is a porphyry zone with a gold-copper mineralization. In addition to an existing open pit mine, Newcrest Mining has determined that panel caving technology is the best means to extract the ore body and to deliver expected economic benefits. The Cadia East project is um, a, a sizeable underground project for Newcrest. Uh, it's a gold project and when developed will be one of the largest underground mines in Australia and one of the largest underground gold mines. Newcrest Mining selected Fluor as their owner's representative for all project engineering, procurement and construction deliverables on Cadia East. Fluor initially conducted the feasibility study, while Newcrest completed development of a seven kilometre underground decline to access the ore body. Fluor worked closely with engineering designers and Newcrest Mining Limited to determine the optimal mining and processing methods. Fluor's follow-on work scope included surface and underground infrastructure, crushing and lateral materials handling, underground conveyors and the surface process plant and associated facilities. Fluor also had commissioning responsibility for all new facilities and services. Trying to do the work that we're doing in and around in a very congested area on an operating site without any sizeable or any substantial interaction or interruption to the operations. Uh, has proven to be extremely challenging. Installation of the underground facilities involved extensive daily coordination with mining operations for access of personnel and material, as well as daily blasting schedules. Fluor was able to reduce site congestion by maximizing the pre-assembly of equipment above ground. Staffing a large project expansion in a rural community created a logistics challenge that required housing of 1,000 employees and transportation to and from the site each day. Everything that we do is planned with safety first. Um, and really the focus that we've had here at Cadia has been to interact and to work in with Newcrest to ensure that the fluor culture blends with the Newcrest culture to ensure that both the operations people and the uh, construction people can, can execute their works um, safely and without impact on the project. Fluor successfully completed Cadia East in 2012. Newcrest Mining's $1.9 billion development of the Cadia East site ensures a long-life mining operation and efficient use of existing infrastructure and resources.